Hey guys, Steve here for Who Took My Dice Miniature Wargaming. Uh, it's Thursday. Happy Thursday, everybody. So, this is just a quick update, uh, plus a run through of what's on my painting table right now. So, update first. Um, the next bunch of videos are all going to be about uh, my Beast of War entry. Um, and because of that, I've actually had to go through some of my paints and glues to see what's working, what's not. Turns out I need super glue, I need PVA glue, so basing those pieces is going to be put on hold until I go out and get that. Uh, I need some new paints here and there, black paint. Uh, I'm probably going to pick up just a dollar store acrylic to base those things with, and a gray as well. Um, work has been crazy, I've been working a lot lately, so that's kind of put a damper on, 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 uh, on putting out content for you guys. I'm hoping to put a bunch more over the next couple weeks because I'm running out of time before I go back to school. And just so everybody knows, I am going back to school in September, but that doesn't mean this channel is just going to stop. I am going to put out stuff. It'll come at a slower rate, but I am still going to put out content for you guys because uh, those of you who've hopped on the channel, I've had lots of positive comments. I want to keep that coming up for you. I really appreciate all the positive comments, all the people have hopped on. Um, it's been great. It's been more than I can ever imagine. Um, the only thing I ask is please, guys, please, 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 send me, uh, send me questions, please. Just send me whatever questions you've got. I have a handful. I want to make a longer video than that. Um, and send me anything. If you want to know anything about what it was like to work uh, on Frontline and Games Workshop, uh, my views on any of the, the, the tabletop stuff that's happened recently, whether it was a few years ago with um, the fallout of the uh, Games Workshop uh, chapter house stuff, the way that things are coming out now, there's tons of stuff. Like I said, I've been doing this for 20 plus years. I've seen a lot. If you have any questions about previous videos, you wanted any, uh, explanation or, or expansion on any of the things I covered in those, please, uh, put them in the comments below, put them on the comments below on any, uh, any video you watch. I'm going to review them all. It'll, I'll get it all. Don't worry. And I'll do a nice big, uh, FAQ for you guys. So frequently asked questions or Q and A, whatever you want to call it, right? Uh, the other thing is I went through my bits box, I organized everything, found a bunch of stuff, and the one thing that really surprised me is I found my old, uh, uh, Warhound Titan. Found one, yes. How does he want to lose one? You'll see. Um, so I'm going to cut to, uh, the stuff that's on my painting list right now. Uh, some new stuff, some old stuff, some stuff I've been working on for a while, and, uh, without any further interruption... Here we go. So here's the first squad I'm working on. Uh, it's actually made up of a bunch of different space screen parts. So uh, we've got the uh, we've got the, the unpainted bits there are actually off of the new Ultramarine uh, chapter upgrade sprue. Uh, so we have the two different heads there, the shoulder pads. Uh, this guy over here has an old metal arm from the uh, Iron Warrior set. Or sorry, say Iron. Yeah, Iron Hands, so Iron Hands and Iron Warriors. I actually use a bolter that I uh, kind of mashed together. It's just your standard bolter, but I clipped off its old sickle clip and put in a Terminator, uh, or sorry, Storm Bolter uh, clip on there. Uh, these three guys here all have uh, Blood Angel heads. I just want something different. I didn't want the same, hey, look, everybody's got the same bloody helmet on for the squad. They're on the newer bases as well. Uh, I haven't decided whether I'm going to make them just another tactical squad or maybe make them a command squad for my ninth company. As you saw in all my other videos there, my uh, For the Emperor video, I did have a ninth company captain I built up out of uh, just extra bits and uh, a, a uh, limited edition space ring. Next over here, I have my assault squad that I've been working on for a long time. Um, I had these guys actually standing, I wanted them to look like they're actually in uh, sort of battle poses. And the sergeant here, I actually placed his head with another head off the Ultramarine Upgrade Sprue. Uh, I just wanted to, you know, a veteran looking guy. Uh, next is this Black Templar Marshal I built up. Now this, this happy guy here, I first built him as sort of an experiment. I saw in, wow, an older white dwarf now, um, one, of their, one of their contributors decided that he wanted to up, make his space marines look large like they're supposed to make make them actually seem larger than say a guardsman because right now uh, even right now the space marines pretty much the same height as a guardsman 
So this guy, I just took Terminator legs, a assault marine torso that I flipped upside down and carved up a bit. Um, that uh, purity seal right there is actually off a of Ravenwing sprue. And then I just used the standard Terminator uh, power fist in the storm bolt arm. Replaced, I, I actually took a bolter from the command squad sprue and then did another chop. Give it uh, the bottom of a uh, storm bolter. And yeah, I just paint them up. And then if we look up here, what? Wait, where's where's the warlord? Oh, oh wait, oh, or oh, not the warlord, but the warhound. It, it, oh, it's down here. Oh, oh, I'm such a little stinker. Yes, this is a epic scale warhound. Found it in my bits box, buried under stuff. Uh, I'm actually going to paint that up. I, I, I got this from a co-worker of mine years and years and years ago. And I never really did, with, did anything with it. Put on a base. That was pretty much it. But I am actually going to get that painted up now. Um, so yeah. Not a real Warhound, I wish. But there you go. So that is what's on my block right now. Definitely want to get the Assault Squad done. Add some uh, more close combat punch to my, uh, my army. And yeah, th these guys. Still not sure what I'm going to do with them. Either I'm going to make them another uh, tactical squad, maybe for a second or fourth company. Or maybe make them a uh, command squad for a uh, for my ninth company. Not sure yet. But yeah, so that is what's on my painting block right now. Zoom out a bit. Woo, look at everything. Yay. Woo. So there you have it, guys. That's what's on my, uh, my painting block right now. Um... I'll get that done up as soon as I possibly can and do an update on them. Show you my progress. So yeah, Beasts of War. That's my big thing right now. Going to try and get as much content as I can before September. Lots of painting to do. Sorry about the Warhound joke. I thought it was funny. It probably wasn't. People probably, I'm like, what's wrong with this guy? Stop him now. But anyways, if you like what you saw here, what you've seen, please hit the like button. Share it with your friends. Subscribe. Questions, comments down below. Email them to me. Who took my dice one at gmail.com? Just send me those questions. I'm really looking forward to hear what you guys want to know. Um, until then, guys, keep rolling dice, and I'll see you later.